Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Alicia and today's video will be for my March TBR. So first things first with my March TBR, this will be the first month where I've kind of scaled back a few things. I was starting the year off with 10 books per month and I've decided that maybe that's a little too much at least to like set up the month. So I decided to scale it back to 6 and then if I read extra, I read extra. So. That's how my future TBRs will go. Six books, so let's see what I will be reading for the month of March. The first one is A Behemoth, but I only have to read half of it as this is for my Reading by Candlelight book club, which I co-host with Katie from Kit Cats Can Read and Sam from The Yarn Reader. And for March and April, so you'll see this again, we will be reading Sarah J Mass's House of Flame and Shadow. We only have to get to the middle of the book, which is about 400 pages in, so I will be reading that, Pro this one probably closer to the end of the month, so I can just read straight through from March to April. The second book on my TBR is for the So Moted Bee book club, and that is with Sam over at Yarn Reader. She hosts this book club, and I join in every month. We typically do read some witchy reads, whether it be nonfiction, fiction, or the like. For March, we will be reading Root and Ritual by Becca Piastrelli. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, but this one looks kind of fun. It does have some pictures along the way, so I look forward to seeing what that one has in store for us. Now, every month I do try to read a non-fiction book, and this one has come up on my TBR again or before, but I did not get to it, so the little slip of paper went back in the jar and it was pulled out this month, so we'll be doing Living Well and Spending Less by Ruth Sukop. I'm not sure if that is the pronunciation, I'm sorry, but this is the nonfiction, kind of small, so hopefully we can get to it this month. The next one, this is my rom-com for the month. We are going to be reading Icebreaker by Hannah Grace. I have been hearing a lot of different things about this one. Mostly good, some go, eh, I didn't like it. So I'm going to read it and see how I rate it myself. She is also going to be a new to me author, Hannah Grace. So that's my first book by her. Hopefully it's a good one and I can continue on with her books. The next one will be part of the Finishing Out series and for this one it is the Percy Jackson. We will be reading The Titan's Curse. The last book on my TBR for the month is a graphic novel and it is Amulet Volume 9 Wave Writer. This one I got from my local library, but nonetheless, I am excited to read it. I have read the whole series up until this point. Now, if for some reason I do get through all of those, there is one book that I would like to read and continue the reread of the series, and that is Covet by Tracy Wolf. I've already read this one. This will be my third read through, I think. Second or third? I think it's my third. I'm not 100% sure. But I would like to um, do some annotating on this one and then continue the series. I am reading these in preparation for the new series that she has coming out in May. But that is all of the books that I plan on reading. Like I said, if I read more, then I read more. I do have a list of books that I did not get to in January and one or two in February. So if I don't 
If I read all of these, then I will focus on those first before picking something new. Well, that is all for me in this video, guys. If you liked this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And it helps the channel grow. So I look forward to seeing all of the comments. If you want me to prioritize any of those over the others, let me know in the comments. If you've read some of these and you liked them, you can share those thoughts too. But until next time, happy reading and bye!